subscribe to the YouTube channel and also click the bell icon to get all the notifications of latest videos. Name, John T. Rhodes. Born July 27, 1969. In Pyotimaritzburg, Natal. Teams, Ireland, South Africa, Won Warriors, Virgo Super Kings, South Africa Legends. Bat Style, Right-Handed Bat. Bowl Style, Right Arm Medium. Statistics, 52 Test Matches. 80 Innings. 2,532 runs at an average of 35.17 with 317 50s. Highest score 117. 245 ODI matches. 220 innings. 5,935 runs at an average of 35.12 with 233 50s. Highest score 121. Journey of John T. Rhodes. Fielding, one of the three aspects in cricket was not given as much importance as batting or bowling, until this man showed up. Jaunty announced himself on the world stage when he flung in the air and ran out in Zama Mulhak in the 1992 World Cup game against Pakistan. The ball had rolled out towards Rhodes who ran in from backward point, gathered the ball and raced the retreating in Zamam to the wicket. Rhodes, with ball in hand, dived full length to break the stumps and effect the run out. The run out, the subject of a famous photograph by Jim Fennick, is still considered one of the most spectacular feats of that World Cup and the defining moment of Rhodes' career. He was very agile, thanks to playing hockey in his younger days, and made the backward point region a very important position in the field. Jaunty was also a very hard worker, playing cricket did not come naturally to him. For the first few years, he made it to the team only because of his fielding prowess but he soon realized that he had to contribute with the bat as well. A complete change in his batting technique, helped him improve his skills as a batsman. After the change, he averaged more than 50 in tests and in OD as he was a innovative, and was one of the first batsmen to play the reverse sweep. On the 14th of November 1993 Rhodes took a world record of 5 catches, to achieve the most dismissals by a fielder other than a wicketkeeper against the West Indies at Brabon Stadium, Mumbai. Rhodes was also one of the first cricketers to take paternity leave, he took a semi-retirement when his daughter was born. At one stage in his career, Jaunty had more endorsements than any other team sports player in South Africa. An unfortunate fracture on the finger during the 2003 World Cup cut short his career. He soon retired and went on to play for Gloucestershire in county cricket. After retiring from all forms of cricket, Jaunty was hired by Standard Bank as an account executive. He was also the fielding coach of the South African national team and Mumbai Indians in the IPL. Now he is the fielding coach of Punjab Kings. Interesting facts, Jaunty was called for hockey trials to the 1996 Olympics, but he was ruled out due to an hamstring injury. He was voted as one of Wisden Cricketers of the Year in 1999. In SABC3's Great South Africans television series, Jaunty was voted 29th in the top 100 South Africans. Thanks for watching.